Last time we met a cold-blooded beast that was hard to see. This time it's a leopard, but with no spots. Jamie, tell me more. Yeah, that's right. This uh, albino leopard gecko here doesn't have any spots because it's been bred that way. Unlike this normal leopard gecko here that does have spots. People like to have choice and captive breeding ensures a variety of looks is available. When it comes to leopard geckos, the albino is just one. Why are they so popular as pets? Well, they don't grow much bigger than this one. They eat a lot less than cats and dogs, and they're really easy to handle, and they have a real personality. They're so small and cute. How do they protect themselves from predators? When it's threatened, it can drop its tail off, just like unhooking a caravan from a car, and then it runs away, leaving its tail behind to distract the predator. Don't worry, it will grow a new tail over a period of time. Thanks very much for that, Jamie. It was a real pleasure. And I hope you've enjoyed meeting some of Scotland's cold-blooded beasts as much as I have.